Welcome to the Sweet Life of AutoCAD. My name is Mel, and I'm here to show you the great benefits of using Autodesk Design Suite. Just think of it as the AutoCAD Suite. In these short tutorials, I'm going to walk you through different parts of the suite that you may not have used or even seen before. Today we're going to focus on Sketchbook Designer. In part two of our Sketchbook Designer focus, we're going to talk about layers. So if you missed part one, make sure that you go back and watch it, but just in case you missed it, let's watch it and fast forward. So I picked a chair that I liked, looked at the side, decided I was going to make it in AutoCAD. I started with the spline. I didn't really like it too much, so I decided to go into Sketchbook Designer. I created a canvas, picked the size, the underlay vector, and boom, created a canvas. Now you're up to date. Once we have a canvas, one button from inside of AutoCAD will take us to Sketchbook Designer. The layer that you see in pink contains the information that we brought from AutoCAD. I'm going to convert that layer to a vector layer so that I can manipulate the information inside a sketchbook designer. Now I am able to manipulate the AutoCAD data. I can also start with a new layer and freehand sketch new concepts. We will cover that in more detail later. Right now, let us take a closer look at layers. The layer manager can show or hide the layers on the canvas. How do layers work? They build on each other. Each layer is clear until you add something to it. These individual layers can be further customized using the Layers Properties tab. We can change its opacity, apply different styles of blending, and even add symmetry. Now let's take a closer look at creative uses of layers. Here is a landscape design that looks a lot sharper with the Multiply blend. And here, transparency is used to compare models from AutoCAD to 3ds Max design. We will stop here for today, but don't forget to check out our website or follow me on Twitter for more information. Till next time.